lots of news, some Black Friday information, some information on new items coming through. And the big news of the week, obviously, is the big launch of Disney Infinity 2.0, the originals, all the original stuff. So we're going to be talking in that in some depth. Okay, so uh, let's kick off with some of the news. Okay, so the big news of the week was um, Tron was, well, uh, not really officially announced, but Disney put out a update to the PC version, and you could go in there, you could go into the Hall of Heroes, and you could then see the two statues for um, Sam, and is it Quagora? Cora. Uh, Cora. Yeah, I'm trying to yeah. pronounce the Q there. And then there was also two power discs as well. Um, so I'm just going to bring up some images here. So we have the Tron Legacy Light Cycle Power Disc and the Light Jet. These are the two power discs. And then we have um, Sam Flynn and Cora. Was it? I got, got lost it again. Cora. <laughs> yeah. Cora. Yeah. The two gameplay videos are up on the YouTube channel, um, so you can see them as well. So, Abe, hey, what do you think of this news? I think somebody messed up. <laughs> <laughs> I think uh, when they did the update on, on PC, I, I don't think they were supposed to uh, also release the um, Tron figure information, but I guess, you know, miscommunications happen. That's just my opinion, but... Uh, either, either way, um, there was a little leak a while back. Uh, we didn't really touch on it because we weren't really sure if it was official, but it definitely is for sure. Um, I am very excited with the way Korra looks, even though I'm not 100% sure if that's how her figure will look, uh, but I do like the way she looks in-game. Sam, on the other hand, uh, I just feel like we just got one of the uh, enemies from Guardians of the Galaxy as a figure because he's in a helmet. So either way, <laughs> it's still a cool figure, but... Um, it's cool to have Tron. I mean, we, we've been wanting some Tron stuff since 1.0. And um, even though these weren't the two we were expecting, uh, I, I guess they're okay. They're okay. And, and like I said, I like Korra, so. Yeah. Um, I First off, the, the way that it sort of got released, I mean, I was it was one of those things that the team were trying desperately to try and sort of keep things back for us to see if they could do... Basically, this is going to be sort of DLC in some ways in the respect that this is not especially on the on the game yet. They've got to send an update through your software to be able to play it. There's still going to be figures. They're still going to be there. It just means your console has to be connected to the internet. So this is all part of, I think, a future plan. Of, this is almost like a test run, in my view, to see how it responds. Because in the future, they might, for example, like, you know, like the villains and stuff, we might not have actually seen them on the disc. They can update it later and keep the news rolling rather than having like little leaks. So the fact that it came out on the PC version, um, I was surprised we got that leak. And, you know, I logged onto my PC account and I went through and I recorded the footage of sort of all those images and the videos that pop up on the YouTube channel. And, yeah, like I said, they, they, they look cool. Um, I'm going to be honest, I'm not... I wouldn't say I'm a huge Tron fan. Uh, I remember watching the first movie when I was a kid and pretty much sort of forgot about it to be honest and I saw the new Tron Legacy movie and I wasn't really that sort of blown away with it I haven't watched the cartoon so that's I'll put my hands up there I haven't seen it so it's not a huge blast for something that I'm kind of going ooh Tron awesome <laughs> but I'm kind of glad that they're doing something that the fans requested because it was really well requested after everyone had those power discs last year and I'm like I'm liking the fact that they're delving into other brands and other categories, and you know there's, there's fans of Tron, so why not give them a figure? You know, not everything can be princesses and sort of the brand new movie this year. Tron's a bit far out there, but why not? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, uh, I I wasn't much of a Tron fan growing up, but um, I I slowly got into it, and I, I do enjoy it. I don't want to say I'm like a diehard fan, but um. It's cool. I, I, I like you said. I'm glad that they're branching out and using other uh, intellectual properties that they have. So, it's cool. Yeah, and it was you know this is the thing of I think specifically with 2.0 is they went with the, what people had asked for, and people were asking for Tron, so they've given it to them. And also, I think generally video game people and sort of Tron kind of go hand in hand. 
Oh, yeah, absolutely. Um, I know I have read a lot of stuff about like Tron basically not being a huge success. Um, the movie and the cartoon because they've cancelled the cartoon and there is rumblings of a new movie sort of in sort of development or something. But a bit of an it's kind of thing. It's a bit of a left field. I think a lot of people, if you were expecting you know a huge Disney character, and uh, that's maybe slightly disappointing, but. You know, I would have been the same. I, to be honest, if it had been Gravity Falls figures, I would have felt exactly the same. Uh, a lot of people would be in uh, disagreeing with you. <laughs> yeah, I did actually. I sat down the other night and I did actually um, try and. Oh, I think we just lost Abe there. Um, and is he back? He's I'm back sorry. in the room. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I actually did try and watch um, about 20 minutes of the first episode of Gravity Falls the other day. Um, just to try and sort of understand, I can see why people like it. Uh, it's, I think I'm going to need to give a couple of episodes a go before I kind of get into it. But yeah, that was good. And speaking of Gravity Falls, um, apparently the um, creator and JV were have, they had a little bit of a, a spat on Twitter this week, um, kind of sort of saying, kind of you know, each blaming each other for it not being sort of in the game already, them sort of saying about getting getting their teams together to get the figures in the game, and Alex said, well, if it was up to me, they'd have already been in it. So suddenly there's been a bit of a flurry of people sort of excited about Gravity Falls. Yeah, and um, I think one of the little things they, they mentioned too was not only uh, would it be Dipper and Mabel, but apparently Grunkle Stan would also be a figure, so that's kind of cool too. I think I think you know three point zero. They're gonna they're gonna start. They're gonna shoot. They seem to be shoehorning Gravity Falls into as much stuff as possible. Yeah, absolutely. So, yeah. oh, what was that? <laughs> I know, I had no, no that's all right. <laughs> <laughs> I know that is really like wild noise. Anyway, um, so we've got those Tron. We've got those two power discs as well that are coming out. That would explain why the Tron cycle image that we saw we could never we couldn't buy the item. Yeah, in, in game, yeah, we couldn't yeah. because uh, apparently, you know, I guess this is it. It's a power disc. So. Yes, there is going to be a ultimate unlock. So if you get all of the Disney figures, you will be able to get a special toy. We don't know what that is yet. That's at least another little surprise for us. Although there have been leaks on the guides, I believe. <laughs> yeah, no, they they did the, they did the leak for the start for the Marvel one. That's right, released, it's the Marvel side. In the That's true. in the Marvel Hall of Superheroes, but the Hall of Heroes. You can. There's a little um, cave that opens up. So when we get the yeah. Tron figures, we'll find that out. I must admit, I was. I'm still hoping, but I don't think it's going to happen. Um, I think those Tron figures are going to be sold as a twin pack with the the two power discs. No playset. That was a big. That looks to be. If they've gone the power disc route, it doesn't look like we're getting the playset. No playsets. No. They're gone. Yeah. <laughs> I. I just. It's. I, I sort of thought, well, I thought, is there a chance that they might try and shoehorn a a, um, a, a Disney playset in if they had chance? Because, you know, they had maybe a few more months to kind of develop it, but it doesn't look like it. 